All right. Well, it's uh, it's not side job Sunday. It's uh, I ain't got nothing to do Saturday, and it's going to be raining on Sunday. So I want to work on a another project. I got a wild idea on for the the Dodge Oddball. Um, I bought a uh, a place for a you know USB plugs for charging phones and around the YouTube or the GoPro cameras and stuff like that on Amazon. Oh, I didn't want to cut a hole in the dash. And so oh, I got this idea that I'm going to take this old ammo can. And this is not a very old. I wish this was an older can where it had like 50 cal on the side. It would kind of go with the, the truck. So this one I don't mind cutting up and uh, just repainting it all. It's a little rusty up here. And I don't paint, you know, paint over all that because it doesn't really fit the right year. But I got a couple of these uh, stainless steel cups for boats that I'm gonna cut two holes on the top. I'm gonna cut and install this on the side and bolt it down in the center of the, on the floorboard where I can run the wires underneath the floorboard to the battery and have a couple cup holders. And this has a, uh, a hasp with a lock on there. I can, you know, just keep that kind of locked up or if I wanna keep uh, something in there that needs to be locked up while I'm doing stuff, so. All right, we'll work on this with uh, this this thing. And of course, no job will be complete unless you have a Ryobi tool selection. So we'll start off with the uh, Ryobi drill and move into the Ryobi sander. And they'll probably have to use a Dremel tool to make these size this fit perfectly. And then uh, go from there. All right, check back later. This is not going as easy as I thought it would. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay, some things you can't do with one hand. Some things you can. Let's screw that. All right. Um, let's see where we're at here. I got the one cut out, and I just have to do a little bit of trimming. Well, that's why I got my Ryobi Dremel tool, so I just got to... Trim that up just a little bit. Get that fit in there, and I'll start working on the other one here. So, yeah, apparently the measurements I got off of this are supposed to be 90 millimeters, but I guess it's not. So I need to do a little, a little trimming. But no problem. You know, what does a walrus and tupperware have in common? They both like a tight seal. All right, let's check her out. My cup holder console is all done. Got a little touch up on the paint, but it's gonna get banged around pretty good. So let's try it out. And it works. It's got a place for a little lock right here. I just gotta bolt it down. Uh, tomorrow and run the wiring Put in a fuse. I'm gonna do it right. So I got the little hole in the middle Siliconed up so it won't leak inside. And I just want to once I get bolted in I'll put like a rubber piece out of one of my mud flaps But there it is That's my uh, Center console and charging port from my doge Wah wah wah